Hello, my sisters. Thank y'all for looking at my video yesterday. Oh, I thank y'all for coming back today. Oh, let's say prayers and then we are get into this thing today with your one only hood girl. Hello. Give me a moment. Father God, thank you for this beautiful, blessed, and awesome day. You are so awesome. I just want to do a thank you prayer for everything big, small that you bestow upon us with mercy and grace and love and divine favor. Thank you. Thank you for looking beyond our faults. Thank you for giving us another day to do good by it, Lord. Yeah, use us like you do. In the name of Jesus, let this food be nourishment to this beautiful and healthy body. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen and amen. My God, thank you. Thank you. All right, y'all. What we eating today? We got them spicy noodles. Look at that. Them spicy noodles, y'all. I was going to do five packs, and I'm thinking, should I really do five packs? Well, I did two. Let's see how much of this we're going to get down. Look at, look at that red. Oh, my, 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 my. And I'm going to be introducing... Kirk and Jay's Barbecue right here in my own area of Seabrook, Texas. You will find them next to the Shell Station. So look at this card, y'all. This is it. Y'all see it? I'm going to tell you, the first time I went in, I met Kirk. Very friendly, friendly man. I had ribs then, and I think I had sausage. Uh, it was so darn yummy. So I thought, well, I wanted to do chicken and noodles and hot spicy noodles today. And I was like, well, I got somebody right here in my neighborhood who has some good, good food. Check them out. Hit his card again, y'all. Go check them out. You, you won't be uh, disappointed, that's for sure. And so when you see the bald-headed man, that's Kirk. Okay, towel with glasses on. That would be the owner. Shake his hand. He's a very friendly man. Okay, y'all, we got chicken. Look how, you know, I think he got this chicken from a, let me see, yeah, oh, some, look at this, y'all, look at this leg. Look how big that leg is. Ooh, tell me I ain't gonna have fun with that. And I took out my two times spicy, y'all, but I don't know if I'm gonna braid that today. And of course, y'all, what do we have? Mm -hmm. That cocktail, because we're going to get back to that story that was uh, le I left off on yesterday. So, here we go, y'all. Come on in. Take a seat. Bring your cocktail, your water, or your Kool-Aid. Bring your food or snacks, as we are about to sip and chat with this only one hood girl. Holla. Let's get started. I'm kind of rushing. Oh, that's good. I'm kind of rushing right now, y'all. Cause I have something to do, but so let's get. Oh, I know, I know this is gonna be so spicy. Do y'all know how to work uh, chopsticks? I do. <laughs> Here we go, y'all. But these are my favorite noodles, though. I'm cutting my head out, huh? Oh, it's hot. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. My God, that's hot with fire. And then that spice just kicked in on these taste buds, y'all. So I'm going to talk and eat today. I will say let me eat a little bit first and then talk, but we're going to try to talk and eat like we do. Oh, that's going to be so hot. You know, but let me bite this darn chicken, y'all. I have I guess I could have asked for some um, barbecue sauce on the side, but it has just a smidgen already 
Oh, I hear that cook name. This is good, y'all. Mm-hmm. Uh, that leg, you can use it for a weapon. <laughs> Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. That's good. Oh, yeah, it's all over my mouth, ain't it? Mm -hmm. So let's get started. I told you that fool. He reached out and did a foolish thing again, y'all. Am I too close? I don't care. I get to see my brother. Mm -hmm. Again, he decided that something he didn't like what I was doing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -mm. Something I said. Oh, mm-mm. Oh, that's hot. Ooh. He wanted some nasty. He wanted me to do the nasty. I didn't feel like doing the nasty that particular day. Now, I'm not going to shy around from doing the nasty now. But sometimes... Depending on what you've gone through, just not in the mood that day. Well, that moment, I was going to give him something in that day, but I just wasn't ready in that particular moment. And we laying side by side. And he, he I guess he was mad because I wasn't, you know, reacting to his advances. He hit me laying down, y'all. <laughs> Oh my, and you know, keep in mind, remember I told y'all yesterday that I used that telephone line, the, the receiver part, it was sitting right on side, but the phone, but the phone itself, we still was using phones then as well. It was sitting on the back side table, y'all. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm. Oh. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 It was sitting on the bedside table. Oh my God, that's good. Mm -mm -mm. I just rolled over and act like I was crying. I wasn't crying. I rolled over and act like I was crying, y'all. But that hand had reached over there and unplugged that thing out that out that slot in that phone. Mm-hmm. I wrapped that goddamn cord around my hand. Let me tell y'all something. Once again, <laughs> unbeknownst to him, he did not know he was going to get clucked. I left just so much of that, that, that card that can, you know, like that slinky, like I tell y'all. Y'all position that sucker right around your hand. It's a good weapon. Well, I'm not going to teach y'all that, but I had to protect myself. I clucked his ass, and uh, right now he walking around with a keyload from here to here. It looked like a phone. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Remember we was laying down, you stupid fool. Don't you remember when the first time, the only and first time you hit me, I made you taste that curling iron hot? Then you, uh, you wait a year later. Did you think I wasn't gonna do it again? Cause maybe you thought I was just so in love with you, it's just so freaking in love with you that I wasn't gonna pr pr protect myself. And I defend myself. I'm going to use that word, not protect, but defend. It's legal. <laughs> Again. Mm-mm. 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 Oh, God. It's good. It's big. Mm-hmm. Um. Y'all know I don't do gristle. Good or not, I don't do gristle. So... Honey, blood once again. It was bad though, y'all. Uh, it scared me. Ooh, shit, that, that's gonna go everywhere, ain't it? Mm, that's better. Mm, hot. Mm, 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 hot. Mm, mm. So, y'all. I clucked his ass again, upside his head that time. Oh, yeah, my mouth is burning. Baby, I had a lock on my, 
outside door at that time, right? My bedroom door. Because, you know, we had some toys and stuff in there. And while I was gone, I didn't want the boys to go, you know, looking around and find some stuff. I was so pissed at him for trying that shit again, y'all. I locked his ass in that door so he wouldn't get out blood in there. And that time I thought about it, I went there and clipped his ass again. He was sitting at the end of that bed just trying to stop that blood. But I didn't know he had called the police. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I didn't know he had called the police. Woo! Look at that. Y'all can even see when I pull it up, huh? You know what? Somebody said with these spicy noodles, if you put some cheese in it, it'll tone down that spice. Y'all, next time I do these spicy noodles, I'm going to use some cheddar cheese. Mm -hmm. I got some fresh cheddar cheese at the deli. The block side, the, the, the triangle side. So I'm going to have to try that. Melt it in here. I ought to do it now, but I don't have time. Uh-oh. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Honey. I heard this, 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 this knock on the door like somebody was trying to not knock, but kick the door. I went to the door and said, who is it? They say, HPD, open the door. And I'm like, oh, this mother chuckled and called the police, old punk ass. I opened up that door. They said we received a phone call from a male uh, stating that something about abuse or something. And I was like, oh. So he started hollering out the back. I'm in here because I had locked the door. They asked me to unlock that door, y'all. I ain't unlocked that door. <laughs> they got, the police officers got mad at me. It was two men and a girl and uh, a lady. And they so they kicked my door open. They did to let him out. And they, I think they gasped when they saw all that blood. Oh, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Y'all, what's wrong with my stuff this day? I'm so sorry. They came in and handcuffed me right and told me I was going to jail for battery or something. So I did my crying thing, y'all. I did that crying thing. Mm, 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 mm. That, but because he hit me, you know, I, you know, I, I'm easily bruised, y'all. Remember? I think it was this side. That we were laying in the bed. It was this side because he swung over. Mm -hmm. I had whelps again. Your finger, your handprint. Mm hmm. Forgot food. You forgot to tell me you hit me first. Mm hmm. I started begging to the lady police officer, y'all, because the men didn't want to hear. They, they saw one of their fallen men. Honey. The men wouldn't have it, so I pleaded and I cried. Y'all know, I, back in the day, I learned how to beg and plead, remember? Honey, I pleaded to that lady. I asked mm. being a police officer, and you know the law, if a man hits you, do you not have a right to hit him back? And I said, look in my face. Look what he did to me before I did that to him. Look. She said, take them handcuffs, take them handcuffs off of her right now. Y'all didn't see her face, did you? Mm-hmm. She kind of winked at me. I just give you. I got you. Mm-hmm. So they asked him, well, they stood guard <laughs> while he packed his shit. Mm-hmm. Very sorry. You wouldn't want to stay here, would you? So he packed his stuff. So they assisted him out the door. I had to go clean up my room. 
I have to throw them sheets away because it was, it was too much blood. I ain't feel bad. I already had gave you fair warning. You put your hand on me. You're gonna, you, 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 you gonna always remember me. Always remember me. You put your hands on me. But that was back then, y'all. That was 30 years ago. I need y'all to keep that in mind. Everybody who's seeing this video today, don't think it's my today's time because I, I will be a murderer. You don't cross those boundaries on me. You see this beautiful body? This beautiful face is going to remain. So he left. So a couple of days later, I'm getting ready to go to work. <laughs> Y'all won't laugh. Y'all, what if I did do five bags? Shoot, I can better get through one, huh? But still pretty. Oh, y'all, wouldn't that have been a, what you call it, a, a thumbnail? Let's see. Well, I'm with the big leg. Oh. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I opened up the door. These really are some good spicy noodles. He had brought his car. Somebody had dropped him off, I guess. He had parked his car long, long, the long way on my driveway, so I went uh, back out. <laughs> I had to get to work, y'all. So I went and knocked on my neighbor's door and said, I might have to, like, come up some and go in your yard to get out. And he just shook his head. <laughs> he said, I don't mind. This hood, do what you have to do. And I said, can you, while I'm doing it, once I get my car, can you have a record company pulled up? Because we, we, we finna have this fool told. You fool enough to go park in my driveway like that? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Same on you, fool. This she ain't want your car. Oh, y'all. But, <clears throat> but I didn't tell y'all what he did in the middle. I missed something. You know, he worked for the railroad, right? And so I guess he allowed his feelings to get so deep in me. You know, my personality will always be my personality. I am going to attract people, whether good or bad. Will you have a, a nice attitude and you speak good towards people you attract people y'all that i didn't tell y'all that fool quit the railroad did i did i tell you hmm. mm -hmm. i didn't tell y'all he quit the railroad to try to keep up with me did i tell y'all that y'all i'm going in I'm going in, y'all. Yeah. I'm getting full. All this talking and eating, I'm getting full. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So good, y'all. So, he quit his job. The best job. Do you know the retirement benefits that's in the railroad? You quit it to keep up with me, and guess what kind of job he got, y'all? Y'all ready? Plumbing. Or well, plumbing company. I ain't going to tell y'all which one, but I, I can picture I can picture that truck right now. I shook my head. That's when he became crazy, y'all, trying to keep up with me. You can't keep up with me. You know, but the fact of the matter is, I don't, if, if I don't, I'm not a cheater. I don't know why they get in their mind. I think they say, this girl's so good. I, I This girl's so good. We, I don't want up with nobody else. You're going to, you're going to, you're going to, I'm going to end up with somebody else when you start acting a damn fool. Mm -hmm. I'm putting a hole in it, y'all, though. Y'all see the side. See the see inside the side. I'm getting full though. Okay. Hmm. I never reheated noodles. I don't think you can do it because they get sticky. 
after a while. And don't they swell up? Because these are them Chinese noodles that you bought off of Amazon. But just so luckily, I was in our Kroger's and they sold it as well. And at that Market 99 store, they sell it. Um, so I had his car towed away, y'all. About a week later, it was on a Saturday morning. I'll never forget it. I was getting ready to go do my grocery shopping. I, on, on still the day, y'all, I do the same thing on Saturdays. I visit, I grocery shop, and I shop. That's what I do. I opened up my door, and this, it was a great day, and I'm ready to get out there in the world. You know, of course, y'all, when I break up, I go to that single mode again. That's where the greatest happiness comes in, too, when I'm single. I opened that door, and, and it scared the shit out of me because it was this big balloon. <laughs> it was this big old balloon. It was tied to a teddy bear, and the teddy bear was sitting on, like, this vase of candy. And, of course, it had a card. <laughs> okay, so. Mm -hmm. The card said, I forgive you. I know I caused it. I'm so sorry. I can't forget you. I love you and I'm in love with you. I can't stop thinking about you. I'll never do it again. I promise. Please call me. Please answer your phone. I'm going to tell y'all what I honestly did. I kept the candy. <laughs> kept the candy. I put a, a the beginning of that part of the scissors, the sharper part. And I bust that. Oh, y'all, look at all this stuff in my mouth. I bust that balloon. I threw the teddy bear away. I've never been one of that collect teddy bears, y'all. I don't, I don't do that. Now, this is bad. It's just not for me. Honey. I, I kept the candy. The candy was pretty good. Mm -mm. So y'all remember when the Nelson company came out and they wanted to come hook something to your TV back then because they was monitoring what you watch? But just so happened I had signed up with them and they they paid you so much money a month to do so. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The Nelson, the Nelson ratings. Well, the guy that came to hook up my equipment on my TV, um, he was just there doing his work, and and I guess homeboy came by and saw a vehicle in my driveway. But of course, I was in that same house with the burglar boss, so he can't get in. And I had the door closed anyway. So he done screamed through the door. I forget what kind of car the Nelson man had, but it was nice. That fool screaming through the door. I love you, Juanita. Is this a, is it a, is it his car? That man looked at me, he said, You dated a guy, he begging at your door. He said, what you do to him? <laughs> Y'all have smoke flavors in this um, chicken. You can taste it. That's when you know it's good and smoke. <sighs> so. He said, can I go out and handle that man? I was like, no, sir, please don't. <laughs> You know, I didn't know him like that. You know. And back in the day, I did know people, for sure. But I was like, no, you you working. Don't go. He said, but he need to get away from your door with that. But I ain't answer the door either. So, of course, the, the landline started going off like crazy. One call after the other. And I knew it was him. Mm-hmm. 
Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Y'all. Now, you know I know darn well I could eat with some chopsticks. What the hell is going on with these chopsticks with me today? I think because I'm rushing. I've gone past time, too. When you have good food. Mm -hmm. Oh, y'all, in this past the time, I'm supposed to stop anyway. <laughs> I'm going to roll. Okay, um, I'm going to stop here. This is the last of my story for the week. We'll just talk about shenanigans on uh, Saturday and Sunday. We will come back to my life, my story. Life goes on on the following Monday. And I'm off as well. So, yay. Thank you so much for coming back. Thank you so much for subscribing. All my new hoosters that's coming in, don't leave without hitting that subscribe button. That notification bell, ding dong, ding dong. So every time I upload a video, you're going to get it. Don't forget to share, like, and comment. And I'll see you guys again on tomorrow. Stay safe. Show love. Show mercy. Live life. Until you see me again. Mwah.